regarding life. Ready? So guys, the critic is back with you, you're up on the road. And what happened? GPL is doing some scheduled maintenance on the East Coast of Collagen, Lusignan, all the way on the East Coast. Some 12,000 households are going to be affected now. We can stop and you can get a look at what's going on here. This is Traspe area. We can stop and you can get a look at what's going on here. And then we go to Lusignan and talk to somebody who's going to give us an idea what is going on. So them guys down the pole there. This is the Traspe area. And let me go down and we can go to Lusignan. And then we can come back to Collagen. Because I want to give you all an in-depth understanding of what's going on. I just received some calls of um, people wondering why the power outage. It's a scheduled maintenance being done by GPL. And here was one of the things, you gotta look at the page and when you got when it's on the page, you sh these things are information. You might not want to share personal things that I am doing, but when you come on the page, as a good citizen, share the, the, the informational things. Share things about COVID-19, about the vaccine, about GPL maintenance, because it can help somebody, right? Who most need it. Some people calling me critic. Is what going on? Why we ain't got light on the East Coast? And we have on our page GPL schedule maintenance. We spoke about it. We put it up there a lot and people did not know, right? So this is this is Buxton we're driving on. Eh? This is um, just about to enter into Buxton. This is Charles Bay, Ali is Charles Bay. Um and vigilance line tap area, right? So I know for long if, if you're from Buxton area. And you're from Tras being vigilance. A lot of you might not have seen this place in a long while. So wow, the lady got a beautiful hat. This, this what, what kind of hat is called with fruits and stuff on it. Yeah, so this is Buxton. We just done in Buxton here. And all these communities are affected by the scheduled maintenance. But as I said again, somebody just called and was asking, um, you know critic we're going on with the electricity supply knowing that I is always dip on the ground and be in the loop with GPL and was what they're doing so you got what you got staff GPL staff there here this is Buxton again and you got some of GPL staff there on the pole right so massive uh, maintenance work going on all the way on the East Coast line top right we're going to Lusignan where we we're gonna to talk to one of the GPL staff and they're gonna to explain to us the point person on the ground. They're gonna to explain to us what is going on. This is Buxton line top here the hay, right? This used to be Buxton market area. For those of you who are from Buxton, um, this is the line top area. And You're tuned in with the guy niche critic. I'm coming to you from the East Coast where GPL is having its scheduled maintenance and when there's a scheduled maintenance is GPL doing work on the line, upgrading the line and otherwise services um, with the intention to giving you a, a reliable electricity supply. So when you hear scheduled maintenance, you know that the supply in sometimes is being affected. And I was informed that some Ill, uh, twelve thousand households are being affected in this in in this case. So we just want people to know what's going on, and I want to find out from GPL what time power is coming on back because this all guy is interested in. A housewife ain't no electronics, and she really and truly don't care. She wanna know when she gets him back light. That's all she's interested in. So we can stop. Talk to somebody here. And um, see what they're doing. 
and I'm looking for some kind of explanation or understanding what really schedule maintenance means in this case and you see they got a big thing for the ground there's a lot of a lot of equipment and all kind of thing changing wow there's a big there's a big thing going on there a man driving through there like he mad being replaced there right but I got some more crews down the side so you see this massive piece of stuff uh, will, will change out from the thing there there's a switch that engages the electricity supply and disengages. This is what you call it a switch. So, I just want to know what's going on, why it's going on, and making sure it didn't go in me. So, Critic is on the ground with GPL and we're on Lozignan line tap. So if you're from the Lozignan area, this is the Lozignan line tap. And we're going to the next location. They got collagen, they got things going on in Buxton. The whole east coast from Lozignan um, all the way up has been affected by GPL schedule maintenance. So I'm trying to get one of the point persons to explain to us what is it about. When you go on the ground, they just now you see there's a huge piece of uh, uh, what, what we call a switch. Why you know it's a switch? I'm supposing they would have a technical electronical engineering term for it, but I know it's a switch because they go there and they, they, they switch it out and turn off your electricity supply for a certain area. Or, or reroute it for a certain area. So, we're going on here. We can see GP. I got the next thing going on here. Again, we're still on the Lusignan line tap. So, them boys got an operation going on here too. And we are going to go to another location and see what it's all about. So let me talk to the point person on the ground here and get an idea exactly what GPL is doing here today. Um, after this exercise, we don't want to have another open 
each plant from this field of five months. Wow. Okay. Five so, unless it is something hitting a pole, that is lightning hitting the wire, that is the citizens could expect electricity, reliable electricity supply for the next five months. That is correct. Beautiful. Once, once it's, it's on plant, yeah. right? Um, well, of course, we cannot um, plant for an emergency, but for plant outages, um, we would have imported some skills from other key locations. Yeah. We would have um, have some contractors on the job so that we could quantify all the defects. I see you got. I see you got another location of the road. I showed them the location. Let's see if you can zoom in and how you can catch. So, right. this, this, is the first, this is the first part. Yes. So, this truck, along with the other truck of the road, those guys came from TV here. Okay. That is across the river, West Bank. Yes. Oh. Right? And just far up the road, there is a team. Um, I don't know if you can see there's a bucket from the bus park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see the change. I, I think it's a switch. The a change, change or something. Switch, right. They call it a GAV switch. Yeah. That is a switch yeah. basically that um, would sectionize the metal. Okay, okay. So from that switch point and then to the east, if we open that switch, that area will be here. Could we expect uh, the residents of this area that is with the power to help us get back here? Right, but our plan is five hours, uh, that is from May. Um, as we speak, everything uh, is going to plan. Progress. It's going to current plan, and we will continue the program. So, beautiful. Thanks, buddy. I'm going yeah. to college and I'm going to look at, at where you got there. Right. And then, um, well, those are actually other teams that are working at college. Areas to make sure that this was done in a five hour period. Correct, right, 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 right. Um, we would have maximized on all the resources that are available to me, right? Um, that is the amount of locations and the contractors that are available. So we don't have to take several locations to address the just, just one, 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 right? And we are going to find the work and get everything done to the time. My brother, thank you very much. I'm going to just show them what's going on in the road and right. Right. at least they'll have an idea of what to expect oh, when you're saying to o'clock it is. Thanks very much for your service. No problem. Right? Safe brother. Uh -huh. So we on the move again. The thing, the thing about it is that I feel very good, you know, you got young, you got a young guy there um, with GPL and hold for me, hold for me, hold for me. Hello? Hello? So, I feel very, very confident in GPL's ability to deliver because of the fact, you know, uh, uh, from from listening to the line, line supervisor or superintendent, whatever you say he is, um, you could realize he's very confident, he's very positive, you understand? And when you come, you see that GPL people is on the ground and working, and that's all I'm interested in. I'm interested in what is being done to see things become better. You see, they got something going on here you see there's a replacement of a pole here right they're trying to move a pole so right away here they got a replacement of a pole so we can drive back we can go to college and look at the operation and rest assured uh, the East Coast corridor for the areas that have been de-energized as the technical term used by GPL uh, staff, the areas that have been de-energized. Take out, go and go and video, the, go and video the thing. But how they are walking with the pole there? I want to see. Okay. 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 Okay.
you see they gotta get when you're removing you put in a new pole but then you gotta get a collaborative effort now to get rid of the old one and and this in itself you see two men holding it with a rope there this in itself pose some dangers right so it's not not always nice and dandy as you would expect what's the critics gone up cameraman now very relevant when they the selling plant in chip and selling dark food and turn entrepreneur them not been gone up yeah so GPL is on the ground of work and we're going back for those of you who are from the Lusignan area you see what's going on them guys got another team here working on different things in the pole they got a number of teams right away through uh, the East Coast area so You would have heard from GPL's point person, the line supervisor, I forget this way he tell me he is, Mr. Tratman, um, as to what they're doing or what area is affected. But you could rest assured that by two o'clock um, today, you would have back a reliable electricity supply. And what I feel nice about is the fact that with this that is being presently done, GPL envision that um, you know you're not gonna have any need for any scheduled maintenance in this area for the next five months. So you could sit on and say, well, watch if lightning hit not now, nothing go bad and so yes yeah, sir. Scheduled maintenance is out five months. That's half of almost half of a year, right? So I think you guys should feel I feel good. For know that we ain't hearing nothing but um discontinuing of electricity supply for the longest time to come five months then we get one more schedule made it's a whole year done without any blackouts right so i feel comfortable with that this is lusignan we are in lusignan uh line tap here um annandale this is annandale for those of you who are from annandale the annandale area this is Annandale and we're just about to enter back into Buxton area where there is some works going on. All this area that I'm driving in has been affected by GPL schedule maintenance today. But rest assured your electricity supply will be back somewhere around the two o'clock hour because you know thing is working again, all right? If something go a little wrong, rain start fall, then banner will go. Well, I don't see rain affecting them because of the fact that they have de-energized the lines. So there's no electricity in the line. I don't see them having a worry to work. I can't beg a man for walking a storm, rain, tearing, falling down, you know. And the weather, you yeah, see the weather. Now this is Buxton, we're in on the line tap, and you got a next team working here, GPL again. 
and they're walking on a on a junction that carries electricity supply into Buxton right as you see them guys they're up there and them guys walking right GPL on the move then we got an operation a massive operation at the collagen junction collagen main road to come in and line tap all of this by the way we're still in Buxton so for those of you who have just tuned in to the Guyanese Clinic um, I'm coming to you from the East Coast I'm on the railway embankment and I'm covering GPL scheduled maintenance from Lusignan, uh, Annandale, Buxton, Tras Bay, and, and a number of the neighboring villages in these communities. The scheduled maintenance has caused a disruption in the electricity supply for five hours. So electricity is expected to be um, reintroduced into the system by two o'clock since the system has been de-energized the, the technical term used has been de-energized and is what I said to take off the current I understand because like sometimes he's get carried away me can't talk your fancy gap down long fancy gap though so they take off the current for make sure when they man up on the post and they lose half them thing and then put on anything then they get right for make sure they don't get shock up and that will make them take off the electricity the current right so you got a next operation here and again this is the Traspe area just before we go into collagen and there's a massive operation in the collagen junction you see these guys working to change things and set up things just stop zooming up there let me see what them about because i want to see people walking me want to see people playing so we're pulling up on collagen we had a little Dropping connectivity there just so we pull it up on collagen here and them guys got a massive operation going on here wow it goes so we got collagen you see the guys on the poles GPL ain't playing if you want to know why you don't have electricity at this time GPL is on the ground and working look all of this is things will change the things on the ground we see there's wires and, and, and fittings that change from the network. You got more guys here on poles again and I was informed by the line supervisor for this area that GPL with this uh, line maintenance is hoping that they would not have any or they will not have any schedule maintenance for the next five months. There might be their possibilities of disruption in the electricity supply if somebody knocked down the pole, if there's a storm, a pole fall, long lightning flash, and these kind of things. But GPL is doing this uh, massive maintenance.